الحمد لله رب العالمين الحمد لله رب العالمين الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على أشرف الأنبياء والمرسلين نبينا وإمامنا محمد صلى الله عليه وعلى آله وأصحابه أجمعين أما بعد As we know, Ramadan is very close by and in our last Ramadan message we focused on establishing local institutions and Alhamdulillah, those of us who are establishing local institutions we know that it is not enough of simply having a collective vision and a collective mission it's not even enough to establish institutions by simply having a thorough comprehensive plan it needs local community support and it needs their their generous donations and alhamdulillah I again the local community uh, of, 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 of the Muslims have been very generous and even globally we have we have been very generous alhamdulillah I however there comes a time when uh, in order for us to really achieve what we uh, make dua for uh, we need to go within the realm of, of, of sacrifice and that is beyond uh, simply being um, generous. A sacrifice means that when we donate, it, 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 we donate uh, such an amount that it, it uh, hurts our nafs. And in our Sharia, Alhamdulillah, we have the concept of donating one third of our whole wealth. We also have the concept of donating half of our wealth. We also have the concept of, of donating all of our wealth if there is a need. And the Sahaba and the Prophets, uh, they uh, attained what they really earned for themselves and for the local community and for the Ummah at large and for the humanity at large once they, not only when they were generous, but when they began to sacrifice their time, their energy, but most importantly, their money. And Jalla makes it very clear by saying, لا يستوي منكم من أنفق من قبل الفتح وقاتل uh, They are not equal the ones who donated uh, and sacrificed um, um, before the uh, opening and conquering and the ones who donated and sacrificed after the opening and conquering. That means that in order for the opening and conquering to take place there needs to be a very high level of uh, generosity but most importantly a very lofty level of sacrifice. So Lord, makes that very clear also in Surah Al-Layl he says فَأَمَّا مَنْ أَعْطَى وَاتَّقَى وَصَدَّقَ مِنْ حُسْنَى فَسَمِنْ يَسْتِرُهُ لِلْيُسْرَى Whosoever has Taqwa secretly in in when, when in, in secret, and whosoever has taqwa uh, openly and in public, and whosoever donates secretly and publicly, that's the cause. The uh, effect of it, Allah says, "Fasanu yastiruhu liyusra." Allah will make their affairs easy, and they will make it uh, easy for them to attain what they yearn for, and what they wish for, and what they make dua for. So my message this Ramadan is to. Uh, sacrifice, sacrifice until it hurts your nafs, and only then, inshallah ta'ala, Jalla wa'ala will give us the tawfiq to attain what we really yearn for and make dua for. Jazakum al khair, taqabullah minna minna salih al amal, may Jalla wa'ala give us the tawfiq and grant us uh, from his mercy the ability and the capability to sacrifice for our local communities and for the Ummah at large and for the humanity at large. Jazakum al khair, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.